Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back with me, your border man, NJ to the city with the number two and TO. This is, um, if I'm correct, this is still Sunday, August the 6th, 2017. Now, um, yeah, about, like, about, to be t about to be 10 minutes till 12, which will carry us into Monday, August the 7th, 2017. Once again, St. John's County Schools starts back on August the 10th, that Thursday. I am super, super excited to pretty much take it, you know, day by day with processes and, you know, you know, do what I can to, again, rep my school, Allen East High School, to the best of my abilities, and to continuously just be the best professional and, you know, I, I can be in the, you know, best school student I can be and continuously just do my job. Because uh, my job is, you know, at least if you have my personality, your job exceeds just being a school student. Your job as well goes to, like, again, you know, caring about other people, being a role model, a mentor, you know, making sure they're on, you know, they're they're cool and they're 100, making sure everybody's, you know, you know, good, gathered and collected, you know, as a good cohesive unit to, once again, make that better tomorrow. But, yeah, um, schools for St. John's County starts, uh this upcoming Thursday, I'm very, I'm, I'm, I'm very excited because who am I kidding? I mean, I've been waiting for this for at least two or three weeks now. So, you know, even though I'm thinking, though, I'm thinking to myself, wow, it's, it's, you know, it's, you know, finally here, you know, finally, you know, last three days of, you know, summer vacation, you know, but then I'm like, wait a minute, didn't, you know, haven't you been waiting for this for like, you know, three weeks or so? Like, I, I have, I have. And like I say, because this year, I do highly believe that, um, like I say, a lot of greatness will come from this year. And um, like I said, I'm just, just going to try to, you know, definitely for the like the, the for the first, the first two days and then next week, I'm going to try what I can to just definitely, definitely just take it day by day. And um, hopefully, hopefully try the best I can to be the best professional, role model, and mentor, ambassador I can, and the best school student I can. You know, towards my grades and towards, you know, this just the, the community itself and just do what I can to own this year during the rest of my time at the school. Because um, once again, we're turning back as a fifth year senior for recovery credits. And my plan is to be out with a diploma by, sorry, out with a diploma by this winter, uh, 2017 winter. But um, we'll see what happens because, um, I mean, that's my plan, but, you know, might exceed that. But hopefully I don't. If I do exceed it, I succeed it. If I don't, then hopefully I come back in 2018 as a volunteer. All by God's grace, once again, Shane God first got over everything. Now the reason for making this video is not really to talk about that. It's really to talk about um, some sports and class models and stuff like that. But who am I kidding? Got 15 minutes, so yeah, why not go ahead and try to you know drum it up as best as I can. Um, so yeah, as well. Um, Again, look out for the uh, project, the, the uh, stopgap project um, that is gonna. That is, um, I'm not. I'm not gonna tell you the title yet. Like, I like for example, my power of influence album. Y'all wasn't supposed to know the title of that until the day it actually dropped. That was supposed to be a surprise album. Y'all weren't supposed to know the date of that until it actually dropped. But then I accidentally said it in a in a previous uh, the viewpoints episode, and then I just ruined that surprise. So. This one I'm definitely uh, keeping strapped and um, um, you know close to me. And I mean, if you if you've been on if you've been under the playlist and you know all the albums that I've released over the last year, you know, then you then you notice a difference. Like you notice that there's another new playlist on there. You know, not gonna say which say which specific one, but you notice there's a new playlist on there that is far from finished. You know, and that is you know that is the 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 new. Uh, album that's dropping on uh, August the 10th because like I say I look at it as this project is perfect to you know get us back into the bat school mood vibe and attitude and personality and you probably like why not just title it the bat school album then because I really feel like the bat school album has more layers to it than this this is a stopgap project for a reason even though bat to school album will hopefully be next month in September this is still I look at this as still a uh, a, um, a, um, uh, I think, what, what, what's the word I just used? Gap stop, something like that. Uh, 
yeah, you know, project. I look at this because, for example, this project is supposed to be like, you know, the the I'm 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 gonna say prelude to, uh, the prelude, um, like this album is supposed to be the prelude to my heart and soul R and B album that is yet to be released. Heart and soul R and B album will most likely be released of uh, this upcoming December. And you probably like, well, why did you tweet out, you know, over the summer and over like, you know, May and April that this album was probably going to come out in June? Well, that was before I started producing some of the songs on it. And I realized that if I really want this to be an R&B album, I'm going to have to take a tad bit longer to, um, you know, produce the songs. You know, make sure that the rhythms are, are right with the beats and make sure all that is where it should be. Because, like I said, I'm not going to put out... This is supposed to be my first R&B album. I'm not going to put out my first R&B album with a bunch of stuff that, like, the lyrics are always going to be quality. But I'm not going to put out, put it out just for the flow and not to match the beats whatsoever. And you think to yourself, what the crap am I listening to? And I don't want you to force yourself to like it. I don't want you to force yourself to listen to it just because just it's new music for me. I don't want you to force yourself. I want you to legitimately listen to it because you want to listen to it. And listen to it because it's, it's of quality. You know, and that's just that that's just my standard stories. And I want you to listen to it because it is it is of quality and you can relate to it and it does sound good. It does sound like it has potential. So, like I say, that um project is gonna be <clears throat> Heart and Soul will be released. If not in December, it will be released definitely sometime later this year. Bad to school album is in September because like I say, the Bad to School album is definitely an album. Like I said, I really just want, I, I really do want those two or three extra weeks to produce that thing because that thing might actually end up coming. It should come in the beginning of, of September, but it might come towards the middle or the end of September. The point is I really want to take my, take, take a few extra weeks to carefully craft that album. You know, same thing with Heart and Soul, which is Heart and Soul with those singing flows. I know when it had to take a lot more time than just a few weeks. I'm going to take a few months to, to, you know, maybe a few months, you know. But definitely, I just know I'm going to have to take a lot longer time than I would, you know, doing the Back to School album. Because the Back to School album is mostly rap, if you ask me. It's mostly rap, but at the same time, I'm telling you, the Back to School album, for me, it just, it just, it just makes it fit just that much more to just go and release in September instead of really releasing it, you know. This August, even though to some of y'all that still sounds like why, because I'm telling you the Bad School album. Like I said, I I forgot the songs are gonna be on the playlist, but I'm telling you that you know if you look at the playlist, I don't I don't think I've even written any songs. That I don't I, I think because I don't know if I've even written the songs that are on the playlist supposed to be on the playlist yet. You know I don't, I don't know if I've even written those songs yet, and if I have written them, like I say, I you know I really want to take just those extra few days or weeks to craft those flows and craft those melodies and, you know, and craft it, you know, I really do want to give y'all, in regards whether it's on iTunes or, or just YouTube or any platform, I want you all to listen to this music and like it, love it, feel it, and I want you to take pride in sharing it with your friends, take pride in playing it wherever you play it, because like I said before, I'm, I, cause I'm in this thing for a long, long, long time, you know, but like I said, I really do just want y'all to, you know, take that, you know, take that pride and confidence in listening to my music and knowing that this guy is the real deal. I can relate to this guy. This guy is the future and he's repping the future and so forth and so forth. Not be like, oh my goodness, why are we listening to this guy? Why are we listening to 15 other guys than him? You know, I want to prove on every album that I release for the rest of my life, pretty much, if not the next five years, that I'm a force to be reckoned with as a young MC in this industry and I'm coming you know, and, and I'm like, you know, and, you know, and I'm out here repping. I'm out here to make a cultural change. I'm out here to do what I got to do to, again, promote and um, promote and expand the positives, expose and abolish the negatives onward to a better tomorrow for all. Like, again, it's all written in the music, so forth and so forth. So, yeah, this video is um, 10 minutes long. I'm going if, if to, if I don't get into sports, this video, I'll get into it next video. But, yeah, like I said, I really want y'all to listen to all the projects that I have to drop this year and um, next year and whatever else years. And I want you to listen to them and be like, this is quality. This is good music. I really want to share this with my friends. Not, not, you know, not, um, not like, oh, I'm just listening to it just to show them support, you know. Because if you ask me, I don't want you to just listen to my music to show me support. I want you to listen because you actually like the music. That I'm making, because trust me, it, it's, there's a difference between buying the music to just support your favorite artist, different from buying it because you actually like it. 
Because you can hate the music, but you're just buying it to support your favorite artist. But you can actually, you know, buy the music because you actually like it. And I want you to listen to it and stream it and whatever else and buy it because you actually like the music. Not just because, you know, I'm a good person, you know, and I'm your f favorite artist. You know, I want you to actually listen to the music, love the lyrics, love the flows, love the melodies, love the love the everything about it. And just be like, this guy is, again, a force to reckon with and we really should, you know, pay attention to him. Uh, Ten minutes into this video. So once again, um... August the 10th, that's when school in St. John's County starts back up. God bless everybody in St. John's County and Duval County, so forth and so forth. I think Duval County starts uh, in the next two weeks, I believe. Because, I, I, no offense to Duval, but I never understood why why that why, why Duval just doesn't give you the entire month of August off when you only have, like, one more week left in school. Like, you know, you're starting right there. You know, you're you're starting right there with the second to last week of August. I never understood why August then just well, why Duval just doesn't give us the you know the you know rest of the, you know rest of the month off. But you know, uh, so forth and so forth. Um, but yeah, eleven minutes of this video. But yeah, um, this project will be coming out on August the tenth, and I do hope that you know or August the eleventh, and but hopefully August the tenth. My goal was to get it out August the tenth, and like I said today, three three more days, ladies and gentlemen, three more days. And um, by the grace of God, we will own this year, and we will definitely do what we got to do to not only own it, but like they make it a year to remember, and just continuously shine on it, and you know what's up, so forth and so forth. And um, yeah, this um, album is really to hopefully help get y'all back into the groove of back to school, and so forth and so forth. And there are there are some songs on here that focuses on love and relationships that I know a lot of y'all can definitely, you know you know, groove to, and there's some songs even on here for the freshmen that, you know, that they should be able to relate to, and I mean songs that are not directly, the songs that I didn't directly make for the freshmen, but they, the, the freshmen are going to be able to relate to it because that transition from middle school to high school, like, you know, I like some of these songs I don't directly make for y'all, but I'm telling you, you're going to be, able, you're going to, you're going to be able to relate to it because of something that you probably have gone through already in, in your life, like, for example, Going into, you know, high school to a certain degree, you know, depending on what, you know, uh, which middle school you went to and which school you're zoned for and so forth and so forth, you might feel like nobody knows you. Even though my nobody knows you and your nobody knows you are probably two different nobody knows us things, you know. But at the same time, it's going to be like, it's still going to be unique to a certain degree because it's like your nobody knows you will be because, you know, you're a freshman, you know. You know, my nobody knows me is because I keep speaking to people over and over and over again about my true personality and my true attitude, my true morals, my true values, my true respects. But yet they still keep lying to themselves over and over and over again and getting everything wrong and continuously, you know, messing up the communication. And that's what my nobody knows me mean. Your nobody knows you would be your freshman going to a, you know, you know, now in high school and not many people know you whatsoever, you know, like, you, like, it's like, for example, like, it's like saying, like, imagine you, like, and, and like, for example, imagine, imagine if your school didn't have link leaders, you know, and nobody from your middle school, or, yeah, nobody from, from, from your middle school came over, you know, to that, to that high school with you, that would be a nobody knows you scenario for you, you know, there's really multiple nobody knows you scenarios, but that's definitely one of them, would be like, you know, because Nice has link leaders. Uh, I'm pretty sure every every school in St. John has link leaders, though, for the for the uh, freshmen. Um, you know, and link leaders are set up there for reasons such as uh, so you can know somebody. You know, you don't so you know so you're not just walking in on like your entire you know first month, first year, not knowing anybody. So you can at least know at least two people, if not you know the rest of the people that you. Uh, the rest of the freshmen that you met during the orientation meeting, so forth and so forth. And this video is almost 15 minutes long. I can definitely go into more uh, analysis on this later on. Thank you very much for listening, watching, viewing, and subscribing. It's me, your boy, the man, Angie to the City. You know what's up. Take care. God bless what once is not a shame. And um, yeah, um, yeah, pretty, yeah, pretty much was discussing the playlist for the new album. And who am I kidding? I'll, I'll continue to do that. But yeah, I didn't get to football in this video, but hopefully I'll get to it in the next video. Thank y'all. God bless. Love you. Peace.